obviously the rebounding was working for you. You ended up with your first career double double. Uh, how did that feel? And what was working for you? Um, you know, some good bounces, uh, but I try to play tough. You know, win a go home game. Uh, you know, there's no other motivation needed, so I just try to get up in the last of the Would you call this a pretty win, and does that matter? No, I wouldn't call it a pretty win. I call it a gritty win. Uh, you know, I think we showed a lot of toughness. You know, they went on some runs, so for us to come back and kind of win it twice there was, it was big, especially down the stretch. When the shots aren't falling, do you guys talk about attacking the hoop more? Yeah, uh, especially early on. Um, I thought we settled a little bit, but we had our defense to fall back on. I thought that was really good, especially, especially in that first half. Muhammad obviously attacking the hoop a lot. Was that something that, that he was focused on? Kind of seemed like he was the only one driving in and getting that contact down low. Yeah, I mean, Muhammad's uh, great going downhill, so you know, we really encourage him to do that all the time. Um, you know, he made some really big plays for, uh, plays for us on the stretch here. You guys had four guys in double figures, a lot of guys stepping up at different times. What does that kind of say about your team? Just that we're balanced, um, especially in a, a night like this where you know, shots didn't necessarily fall. Um, but, you know, we got a bunch of guys we can fall back on, so I think that goes well for us moving forward. All right, guys. Yeah, um, I think that was a transition. Uh, so no time was going to stop and go. Let's go. Go Blue. Just uh, to go on runs like that late in the game, that's big. I, I thought it showed, it showed some toughness. I was going to feel to see Michigan on that actual, you know, round of 64 bracket as opposed to just, the, you know, the, the, the first four. Yeah, uh, definitely. It feels good. Um, you know, we're, we're thrilled to have this opportunity and to come down here and win this one. Um, you know, we're excited, but definitely focus shifts towards Friday. So we're looking forward to that as well. Thoughts on Notre Dame? I mean, they're, they're a good team, obviously, playing in the uh, ACC. That's a tough conference, but uh, you know, we'll uh, rest up. Get ready for them, and we're excited for that. Do you guys, do you guys just like doing things uh, the hard way? I guess, yeah, I guess. Uh, no, nah, credit to them. I mean, you know, we kind of had, we thought we had them there for a sec, but you know, they're a tough team. You know, they showed a lot of mental toughness and resolve, and uh, you know, we were fortunate to make some shots on the stretch. Yeah, I just look back to like the beginning of the year, and for so long, we'd, we'd have the conversation about you know making plays at the end, and the night there was like three or four. Of them. I guess just how adept is this team to? Yeah, you know, winning a game basically at the end. Now. I mean, we played a lot of close ones, especially playing in the Big Ten. Um, you know, every night's going to be a tough one. And, you know, we've proven that we can win close games, and we got guys that are willing to step up and take take and make big shots. Um, so, you know, tournament time. Very rarely are you going to find blowouts or anything like that. There's a lot of great teams, and, and it's and it's multiple guys. It's not giving the ball to Karras and you know. Yeah. Making him go win the game. It's there's three to four different guys. Yeah, exactly. And, um, I think that makes it a lot tougher to guard. Uh, you know, down the stretch, we just try to work for the best shot, and that's being unselfish and playing the right way. Does a 